capture the chemtrails. Well, that one's spread out around here and see the, how they've made the murk around the sun. The sun is just covered in murk, it's just a big blurry murk. Hello thing everybody, I hope this finds you well. The disillusionment of the masses. And that is what the topic is. What is the disillusionment of the masses? Well, it's a plan, you might say, of certain organizations to um, take over nations and peoples from within, take their power from that people put them under their control. How does it work? Well, first they recruit a bunch of people that really don't understand the full aspect of what they're doing. They're taught all the good points, all these nice things. How great it is. Well, they infiltrate these people they get them elected with their money and power that they already possess. They get them elected into offices, positions of power, all the way from the city, local city councils, all the way up to the capital, the capital building and Congress and Senate. And they put their people in those key positions to appoint other people in more important positions, you know, some of them unelected officials, hold high positions in office. So we currently have a government that has uh, a great deal of cronyism going on. A great deal of money being spent on scandalous projects, even wasted, actually. It's another way they used to subvert the people. And the disillusionment, how to disillusion them, is through their religions and their other organizations. They infiltrate religions slowly at first, getting a foot in the door, start spreading false doctrines and teachings, getting people to believe them. And then when uh, they're confronted by the skeptics or the world at large, just the reality of life itself, they become disillusioned with it. And that, my friends, is where the great falling away comes from. The great falling away, as the scripture says, my people die from lack of knowledge. You're taught to accept the authority view on things. After all, they are the authority of the subject. Yeah, right. Man's an authority on folly. Because that's what we usually do with our knowledge. What this country needs is to go back to certain principles, certain things such as integrity ethics. What is your ethos? Why do we have sympathy? It could well be a natural response. Survival thing. We are social animals. We survive best in groups protecting each other. Doing tasks spreading out the labor. How to avoid the disillusionment? 
You ever feel disillusioned? Just remember, God didn't create religion, man did. Trust in God, not man. I'm a man, I make mistakes. I try not to lie. Do my best not to lie. But sometimes I can be mistaken about things. Peace, love, and understanding, everyone. Have a good day.